All right, other half of the uh, minor leagues drop came. I'm pretty sure that's what this is. Uh, so let's jump into this boxing, unboxing. First, let's give a shout out to at Promage Sports Colorado for sending these hats out. Really appreciate that again. And go check out their franchiser at Promage Sports or check them out online at, at promagesports.com. You can also catch uh, their their homies 7PL Customs on Instagram. Let's go ahead and jump into this hat review. Uh, this top. Let's go ahead and try to get the bottom view again. There we go. Open them up from the bottom. Yes, it worked out again. See all those black nasties. <laughs> I see that first one. Yeah, check these out. Here we go. So we start with the front. I'm guessing that's an armadillo. That's pretty cold blooded. Once again, the black UV. And that minor league logo in the back there. Red New Era. I don't know what that is. Initials BS. I like that royal blue on there. Oh, nice! Look at the uh, look at the green or the gray. So it's got a little shadow effect on it. That's pretty sick right there. I like that royal blue. Like I said, they got the royal blue and black batter logo with the white new era. You know how I feel about the white new era, that always pops. HC, I'm guessing that's probably a Angels minor league team. Who knows, D league, could be any number of teams. And I like that back logo too, the black and gold. Batter logo. Oh, nice. And they did the gold new era. Dude. Yes. That's so clean right there. With the black base. I couldn't tell if that was black or navy blue. Still hard to tell. You tell me. What do you think? Put in the comments below. I'll show you the black next to the top blue base, black base. That's pretty sick right there. Oh, look at that. Look at the head of that duck. A uh, down east wood ducks. Dude, that is, that right there, that face, that's a mean looking duck right there. Like how do you make a mallard duck look so tough? I guess like that right there. With the black new era. Oh, nice. Look how they did the, the batter logo. Green and black to match the greens in the duck's face. That hat. I like that hat. A maroon hat. Oh, I was waiting for this one. Teddy Roosevelt with the maroon base and the white. That's kind of an off-white, even. That New Era logo. And then they did, I guess it's maroon. It might be red. No, it's red like the, uh, like the strap around his hat. Yeah, that's cold right there. Teddy Roosevelt. Oh, look at that. A wolf howling to the moon. It looks like he's got like a pirate bandana on. With the black new era. Oh, and the two-tone black bill. That's, yeah, that's the only two-tone that came in my pack. Sick. With the white outline on the wolf to make it pop off the hat. The red and black minor league batter logo on the back 
I like that two tone, that dose tone. Six, six hats in that pack. That's cool. A little six pack. Appreciate you guys out there in Colorado for sending these out at Prome and Sports Colorado. Let's go ahead and we'll put this on pause and we'll go do some research and figure out who these teams are real quick. We'll be back momentarily and we'll have some more information for you on these hats and what these teams, who these teams are. I'm liking this pack. I like that Teddy Roosevelt one right there. And that's clean. They're all clean, man. A armadillo one. I forgot about that one. All right, we're back finally. Not sure if you can tell, but it's nighttime. We've been researching all day. No, I'm just kidding. But we did do some research on these hats and uh, let's go ahead and jump right into it. Once again, got my cheat sheet here. Uh, the first hat here would be the Amarillo Sod Poodles. It's kind of a fun name, but it's an armadillo. And I guess that's the nickname for the armadillo there. The cool thing about this hat, they got the name in a local drawing or contest. They had the locals write in the names and then the league went ahead and had the big dogs start a new brand image around it. And this was the winner, the Sod Poodles. Pretty funny name. It's the alternate two authentic collection on field hat. Amarillo Sod Poodles are an affiliate team of the Arizona Diamondbacks. It's got that red new era. I really like that. That pops. And that'll bring us on to the Biloxi Shuckers. This is the Biloxi Shuckers authentic collection hat in royal blue. Not sure if it comes in any color, other colors. I don't think so. They call this the Road Cap. So I'm guessing they use it when they're playing on the road. They are an affiliate team of the Milwaukee Brewers. They get the name from Biloxi's oyster industry in the city. That's where they come up with the shuckers. That'll move us into the third hat. This hat is very cool to me. Uh, the HC stands for Holy City. And what's cool about this, this team is actually the Charleston River Dogs, but they call Charleston the Holy City because of its religious tolerance. Their affiliate team is the New York Yankees. I'm gonna give you another look at this. Again, that yellow is really popping on the side there. And then that minor league batter logo. All of these hats are just so sick. I really like this one. This one's super clean. I like the blue Biloxi Shuckers hat. That'll bring us into the Down East Wood Ducks. And this is their alternate on-field hat. And they're named after the local waterfowl down there. They are a affiliate team of the Texas Rangers. They're out of North Carolina. They've been around since 2017 from the research that I did. This would be the Rough Riders on-field hat. Uh, that's the Smiling Teddies. They got their nickname from Theodore Roosevelt, who was obviously a president. Um, he was also the leader of the Rough Riders or the first cavalry of volunteers that went to Cuba to fight. And then the, they got the name, the Rough Riders. And so, the team took on the Rough Riders. They are an affiliate team for the Texas Rangers. That in maroon, that hat is very sick. So sick right there. And our final hat is the Erie Sea Dogs. This is the New Era Red Authentic Collection. Um, they call that logo the Howlers logo. 
The other one is just a straight on look at the face. And this is an affiliate team for uh, the Detroit Tigers. And they actually got their name from their original affiliate team, the Pittsburgh Pirates, as well as their location on Lake Erie. So that's a look at the six pack that I got from at Prom and Sports Colorado. Once again, go over there to Instagram and check them out or catch them on TikTok. Uh, you can also catch their homies 7PL Customs on Instagram or go to their franchiser at Prom and Sports or go find them on the web at promandsports.com. You can come over to my Instagram at just hats, no cap. And through my repost, you can get to any of these new drops or any of these shops that are close to you or anybody that you'd like to order from. You can hit them up in their DM and they can pretty much get you hooked up. Um, come over to my Instagram and catch all the latest drops from all the pro images around the nation. And this is where we're going to end it. We appreciate you checking out this edit. We'll catch you on the next one. Peace.